a lot of plants. I'm gonna plant them. Hi, yeah. I want to give a quick shout out to Native for sponsoring this deck build video and for keeping my armpits smelling like fresh flowers, even when the rest of me is smelling like sawdust and sweat. They asked me to focus on their deodorant line, which seemed very fitting considering how much I'm sweating my butt off in this video. Native stays all day with 72 hour odor protection, even with a full day of moving around. Made with familiar and simple ingredients like coconut oil and shea butter, Native's deodorants are vegan and cruelty free and have no aluminums or parabens. I'm excited about the fact that they've started making their deodorants in plastic free packaging. They use 90% post consumer recycled paper and source only from responsibly managed forests. Apparently, I like smelling like any form of plant because my three favorite scents have been their eucalyptus mint, lilac white tea, and cotton and lily combinations. Three deodorants would normally be $39, but if you click the link in my bio and use my code HANALEE2, you'll get them for $26, which is over 33% off. And if you're feeling extra clean, you can also use my code for 20% off any body wash or toothpaste. Are you ready to go mix mint? Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go. The concrete is in here, Molly. Oh, Jesus. You don't want to put too much weight in the wheelbarrow. Can I lift it? Oh, yeah, even it out. Next time you lift it. It's not that. Okay, I'll be here. <laughs> Strawberry one. Little ant, you're gonna get mixed in the cement. You don't even know it. Maybe we just do one to start. Are you ready to hoe? Let's see how it goes. I am a hoe. Oh. Oh my God, we're doing it. They put them in paper bags. I don't know why they did that. Like, why would you do that to something that, if it gets wet, turns into what it's supposed to turn into later? Mm. Molly filled in the first footing. Foot. Footing, foot, 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 footing. Stamp of approval. Hello. The posts are done. Uh, concrete's been poured. There's, I mean, there's one left that I just didn't have enough concrete for. So I'm missing one post. In the meantime, I'm going to start drilling the post holders in. Hair back, folks. My bad. I did not ever, when I was younger, think I'd be doing this in the middle of the woods when I was 28. I don't know what I thought I'd be doing, but this is not it. <sighs> oh, we're in, folks. All right. What the fuck? You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> it goes down deeper than that. Come on. Oh, no. <laughs> Okay, well, F my life. Apparently I made a rookie mistake. I drilled down deeper than I needed to go for the anchor, but apparently I must have, like, the dust must have just compacted at the bottom or something. And now I can't get the anchor out, obviously, because anchors aren't supposed to come out. But now I know. Now I know. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna do this tomorrow when I have a happier mood on. I was so ready to do this. Okie dokie. It is tomorrow. 
Sometimes it's hard to want to include the things that I know I'm doing wrong. I've never built a deck before. I don't know what I'm doing. Could be very easy not to include this. Then I have to remind myself that this is how I'm learning by showing that to you guys. I might be helping somebody else realize that it's okay to fuck up and not know what you're doing all the time. So I'm including it and that's it. End of that discussion. Let's see if I can get this to work. I don't know if I put this on right. I'm a little nervous. You can dream oh, Okay, we can try again. Back to square one. I'm missing something. Oh my life. I've obviously not enough coffee. Learn my lesson. There will be no more debris inside the holes. This had better work. There's no reason it shouldn't. Fuck yeah, that's the way it's supposed to go. worker now. A professional. Go team. Oh my god, it is so hot out. I have to keep going inside and like splash my face with water. It's literally like 94 degrees out right now and humid AF, but I'm doing this. I'm gonna keep working. Second pull. I mean, I'm gonna have to take them out to notch them, but I'm screwing them in so that I can find the. What? Because I gotta level the board that's gonna go across. <laughs> Jesus. Keep having to put all my tools in the shade because it's burning hot. Carried one of these, but now that I've dug all these holes and poured so much cement, I feel stronger. Now, both you come patches inside the fashion house. Oh my god, <gasps> it's happening! It is so fire. Wow. in my eyeballs. This is the corner post, so two notches need to be cut out so that the boards can fit in here. It looks good to me.
Good morning. It's been a while, but I caught a little, or not little, pretty big mouse. See? You're a pretty big dude, huh? And yes, I do know how to distinguish males from females now. <laughs> Deck build's going well. Uh, only thing is I am short by two sleeve anchors, which are very integral to putting in the post holders. I didn't think that would be a problem, except that I have come to realize that they only have them in stock at a place that is over an hour away. So that's where I'm headed. Gotta release the mouse first. Wasting your History been there, done that. Oh, it's you. Only what I can afford. That's everything. I did fill in the hole with concrete though, so that's done.
Okay, hello, good morning. Last step. Put the deck boards down. Ugh. change okay earlier when I said I was gonna put the deck boards on I was lying because I had to put on the deck tape to prevent rot and also nail in the joist now I put the deck boards on and that's the end <laughs> see what it's called whimsical more upbeat music did it. I had to shut the camera off last night because I was exhausted by the end of the day, but I built that. That's freaking nuts. It doesn't feel complete because I'm going to put a hanging day bed here. Not right now because I'm exhausted and that's not going to happen, but as a placeholder, I'm going to put my hammock up. <laughs> 